What's going on Fandroid viewers, I'm Hamza and today we're actually going to be checking out the best TVs we saw at CES 2017. There were literally loads of TVs to actually check out and in today's video we have compiled a list of the best ones we saw. So with that being said, let's get the video started. Starting it off has to be one of the best things we saw in general. This is the LG Signature OLED TV that was being displayed in a sort of surround experience in which we could really get a look at the colours and just how detailed the displays actually are. They also had a wallpaper TV that was seriously thin and it also curves to allow for a more immersive experience. It was just 2.57mm thick which is just insane to think about it because when you actually look at it, it looks as if it's as thin as your smartphone. Next up is this sliding TV from Panasonic that is actually quite practical in the sense that it fits in with a cupboard and allows for more space in your house. As well as it being able to slide, I did also pick up that when turned off, the display was actually see-through. And talking about see-through, they were also showing off another TV that was meant to be integrated into a kitchen. Now, although the picture quality wasn't anywhere as near as good as the others, it was still quite cool to actually get a sense of smart TVs integrated into a home environment, and it gives you a sense of where the future is actually heading. Sony are known for having some of the best TVs on the market, and this time round, they released the Sony Bravia A1e, which comes in a variety of sizes and one of them being 77 inches. It had perfect black colours and according to Sony, it has over 8 million self illumination pixels that are precisely and individually controlled. What I can actually say is this OLED TV delivers up to what people expected and what I was most impressed by was with actually how thin it was. It isn't as thin as the paper TV from LG but this I can kind of see more people picking it up as it is more practical. Something that stood out to me while I was on the show floor was Samsung's insane projector slash TV so they had it in this gigantic gigantic room, the whole projector was amazing, it was just insane and you could really get a look at how detailed and crisp the projector is. Also the colours were very vibrant and in the middle they were actually showing off their TVs which was actually really cool. So this is an insane hybrid between a projector and a TV. But that wraps it up for today's video.